so what we're going to learn how to do is create an animated tooth falling from someone's mouth. This was requested by one of our members, so we're just going to get started. Okay, so what you want to do first is pick your picture, open up your picture, and then um, go to view or window, sorry, and then uh, animation. So this animation window comes up. I'm not going to use that right now, so I'm just going to minimize that. Now the first thing we need to do is zoom in and select the tooth that you want to cut. So, and I'm just going to use the polygon lasso tool here, and then just click to select the tooth. Now, you need to make sure that you use your color picker and select a color from the lips and then change it to the background color so that when you remove the tooth it has that sort of gummy looking color so now that we've cut the tooth we want to paste it by going pressing control V or going to edit and then paste uh, edit and then paste here and then um, we want to drag this layer down to here so it duplicates the layer and you want to make like say five six seven eight copies depends how many how big your picture is and how much animation you want to put in there so I've just made five copies now you want to put the original copy back where it belongs and then the second copies you can just sort of poke around um, and then where you want them to fall, so I'm just going to move them. You can go into edit and then transform and rotate just to give it a sort of effect, a uh, falling, spinning type effect. Okay, edit, transform, rotate, and then rotate it a bit more. Tick, and move this one down here. Edit, transform, rotate. And move this one down here. Edit, transform, rotate. And then finally, tick that. Got the last one. Move it down here. Edit, transform, rotate. And we'll put that one on that angle. Tick. So it should look like that for the moment. Now we want to uh, select the animation bar here and, view, fit on the screen. and then um, we want to select drag this animation and drag it over here so it duplicates it and then just do that for how many teeth you have so I've got five there so now for the original you want to have the first one selected and just have all the extra teeth untick them so they're not visible, then on the second one you want to select a second tooth and on the third one you want to select a third tooth on the fourth one you want to select the fourth tooth on the fifth one you want to select the fifth tooth on the sixth one you want to deselect select that one okay now that should be it. Now if we just play that there, it should give us a effect there. Now if that's going too fast, you can just go here, click here, change the seconds to half a second delay for all of them. And then play that and then it falls a bit slower. Okay, so that's basically it. I hope this is been easy enough to follow for the person that requested this tutorial. Thanks for watching.